The problem with this, and this I think substantiates my point, that it's not just a matter of, hey, I'm enjoying my life and these are the things that I'm enjoying. It has to be some sort of derogatory comparison to family life and parents and children because why mention at the beginning that I am a 35-year-old childless woman and this is what I did this week? The only reason that you would do that is to insinuate that families and parents and children can't do those things, which is kind of a derogatory insinuation, like, oh, you're tied down, the old ball and chain, but I live free as a bird. That's a derogatory insinuation. This is becoming a trend, maybe because selfishness has been a trend in our culture. I know that this is sort of a hot button topic because there's a lot of people who want to be married and want to have families and haven't met the right person yet because of the cultural influences of feminism, because men oftentimes are not are, are, are told that masculinity is toxic, so they don't want, they, they, they're afraid to provide and protect and pursue women because they're afraid of being called some kind of predator. I understand that there are a lot of women at this age who want family life, but society is so backwards right now that it has escaped them thus far. I get that. I'm empathetic to that. But that's not what this is. This is a woman who is actively degrading family life. 